Hi guys, this is Marginus and I'm going to show you how to download and use Mario, which is a program that allows you to download other people's game saves for games such as Borderlands, but rather than describe it to you, you know, you probably already know what it is because you're looking up this tutorial, I'm going to show you how to download it. But first, you're going to need a flash drive for your Xbox, okay? It's a relatively new feature that uh, you can uh, get a flash drive and use that as like an alternate hard drive for your Xbox, but I don't know, basically you need a flash drive, okay? You're going to need to go to your memory settings and all stuff, and then there should be an option to configure it. If you can't uh, configure it to work with your Xbox, then yay for you, you have to get a new flash drive because this one won't work, okay? But once you get one that does work, then you can uh, have it here and you can put a whole bunch of stuff onto it, such as, you know, game saves and, you know, pictures and uh, whatever. But anyway, one thing that you need to use Mayo is you need to have the flash drive, okay? Then you need to put your gamer profile on it, or at least the one that you're going to be using. So I have on here uh, four different profiles, but mainly uh, Marginus, which is the main one that I use, which is my uh, Xbox Live profile. So basically, you put that on there, uh, put it on your flash drive, and you really don't need anything else unless you're trying to modify something that you already have, which is you know, uh, more in-depth and modding and stuff, not part of mod you at all, do not put anything else on here. For example, my uh, game save for Borderlands, all this stuff here, and my uh, downloadable content, it's all on my hard drive, not, not my flash drive, okay? So, basically, put your game profile on your flash drive, nothing else, then you can take out your flash drive, and put it onto your computer. Okay, after you're done with all that, then the real work begins, but it's not really that hard, okay? First, you're gonna open up two Internet Explorer windows. Count them two, okay? I'm using a fancy little tab system, but fact remains, there's still two Internet Explorer things. Go to google.com on each of them, okay? Really simple. Okay? And the first one, type in Mario Download. Okay? Should be the first one that comes up, otherwise you can just go to the link, which is uh, gametoots.com slash community slash mario.php. Okay, you're going to go there and you're gonna, going to uh, download Mario. It's going to be a zip file to a f little place on your desktop. I have right here a little uh, folder, Mario folder thing in that one. Okay. So I already downloaded that to there. It's going to come in a zip file. Very simple. Okay, next you're going to need some kind of a, a extracting program, something that's going to be able to extract zip files, okay? Um, if you don't already have one, uh, just type in WinZip, okay? Go to winzip.com. Okay, something like that. You're going to download WinZip. You don't need to buy it, just download it, okay? You're going to be able to use an evaluation version. But after you're done with all that, close it, open up your Mario folder thing with doing that one. Okay, and then you're going to have this little file here. Not these other ones, you're not going to have those yet. Just type in mod, and you're going to have this, this thing here. Open it. Okay, since that's a zip file, you're, this is going to come up with a WinZip or whatever kind of zip file extracting program thing you have. Okay, now you're going to use the evaluation version. It might take a few seconds to pop up, but I'm already past the 45 day limit, so you know I can't do it. But basically, use the evaluation version. There's going to be a little button that says extract, and you're going to extract to the same folder. So the Mario folder thing, that one. Okay? Then you're going to have this file, this file, and this file as well. You need to open up this one, or as I like to do, I like to right click, send to desktop, and then you end up with this little thing and you can open that instead. While it downloads, or not download, but open, so give it some time. Okay, so this is what's going to pop up for you. What you're going to want to do is you're going to want to register, okay? So you're going to re basically make a new profile on here. I'm already registered, but you know it's pretty straightforward standard process type in username a password and have it sent to your email then uh... have it all whatever but after you're done with that log in okay. then after that you go to the big uh... m button in the corner there 
and you need to go to download a game save. Okay, for the purposes of the, this uh, tutorial, I'm just going to type in my own name and come up with mine. But what you would probably type in normally is, I don't know, Borderlands or something like that, whatever game save that you would want. Then we'll come up with all these different ones, and you can pick and choose, and some don't work, and some do, but, you know, have fun with that after you know what you're doing. Okay, we're going to double click on mine here. And this is actually a pretty good game save, you know, got to say. And uh, basically, you click this download button. You are going to download it to the uh, folder that you have, okay? Now, note the name here. It's going to be save zero zero. Do not rename this, okay? And this will replace any other save of that kind of nature. So if you, by chance, you know, had a uh, save, like the first save or whatever, on your uh, profile from Borderlands, then this would overwrite that. So make sure that you have your stuff backed up or just don't put it on your flash drive. So anyway, I already did that. So that is going to be right in my little folder right here. Notice I have save zero 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 that one. Okay. After you do that, you can go to the big M button again, then open the resigner, okay? And load the file. Do 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 load that file. Okay, you're gonna rehash and resign. Then you're going to rehash and resign again, just to make sure that it worked. Okay, and then you are going to plug in your flash drive, which I just plugged in right now. Okay, rehash and resign, just to make sure. Save to device. Then this is going to be your only device in here, the flash drive. I'm going to double click my gamer tag, which is the one that I'm using. Once OK, you can close out of all of this. Yeah, this doesn't matter. Do not worry about fixing your flash drive or something. Unplug your flash drive. Plug it into your Xbox. When it says to choose a, uh, when it says to choose a device at the beginning of the, when you load up the game, choose your flash drive, and you will have this save on there, and you'll be able to use that. Sometimes it won't work. Don't fret. A lot of them don't. But use mine, and everything will be good. So, uh, yeah. Now you know how to use my and yeah, all that stuff.